iQ7 officially presented, the cheapest smartphone on Snapdragon 888 at a price of $585. The Chinese company Vivo has announced its first flagship smartphone in 2021. The novelty is called iQ7 and will hit the market in about a week and a half. The Pro version with a more advanced main camera is expected soon. The iQ7 is the fourth generation smartphone, despite the name, since after the original iQ came the iQ3 model, and after it, iQ5. The company decided to abandon the paired numbers. The novelty received a 120Hz AMOLED panel with support for the HDR10 Plus standard. The Matrix has an integrated fingerprint sensor, FHD Plus resolution. 6.62 inches diagonal and a small hole in the center at the top for a 16 megapixel selfie camera. On the back there is a triple main camera in the style of the recently announced Vivo X60 model. The set of modules is pleasing, unlike Xiaomi Mi 11. If the first flagship on Snapdragon 888 is equipped with three modules, but does not have a telephoto lens, everything is universal in the new product. There is a zoom lens and an ultra-wide angle unit with a resolution of 13 megapixels and a 48 megapixel main module, Sony MX598, with optical stabilization. Zoom ratio without loss of quality, 2x. You can shoot video in 4K Ultra HD at 30 fps. iQ7 is equipped with a 5 nanometer single chip system Snapdragon 888 with a frequency of up to 2.84 GHz and graphics Adreno 660. The presentation said that in Antu 2 the chipset is gaining almost 753,000 points. So far, this is the world's second smartphone based on this mobile processor, but Samsung will present it a few days later. The novelty is presented in two versions. 8 128GB and 12 256GB. The capacity of the built-in battery is 4000 mAh. One of the main features of the novelty is support for 120 watts fast charging technology. In this case, the package will immediately include a 120 watt AC adapter. According to the manufacturer, the battery can be fully charged in 15 minutes from scratch. 65 watts PD certification allows the charger to be used to recharge laptops. The dimensions of the iQ7 were 162.2 by 75.8 by 8.7 mm, and the weight was almost 210 grams. The novelty supports the Wi-Fi 6 standard, has an NFC chip, a Bluetooth 5.2 adapter and stereo speakers. The Android 11 operating system is supplemented with the original Origin OS firmware. There is no headphone jack and micro slot in the smartphone. The start of sales of the flagship is scheduled for January 21, 2021. The cost of the modification with 8GB of RAM and 128GB of internal memory was $585. The version with 12GB of RAM and a 256GB drive will cost $645. Note that Xiaomi Mi 11 in identical configurations was priced at $610 and $720, respectively. Thus, iQ7 has become the most affordable smartphone in the world on the Snapdragon 888 processor. But this will not last long. Xiaomi today announced that it will release the Snapdragon 888-powered Redmi K40 Pro in February starting at $465.